Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some more Naya Slivers, and we won the die roll up against uh, whatever that guy's name is. I don't know. Um, oh, yeah. Ugh. Ugh. Mulliganing. I don't like it. Uh, I don't like this either. I, like, really don't like this, honestly. Our mana's right, but, like, dang, that's a lot of land. That's a lot of land for just a striking and a muscle. Dang. Well, if this is mono black, which I'm hoping it's not, but if it is, we're in trouble. We're in trouble with a lot of things, unless it's some kind of ramp that'll give us a few turns. Not a, not a great start. Blue. Model blue? Model blue? Agro? What are you doing over here? Hmm, we gonna see white? Hmm, alright, well that helps. That does help. Let's go ahead and play this guy out first. And then next turn we can striking and then winding way to refill a little bit more. Of course, now they're gonna hold up that double blue and be a pain in the butt. But, oh my gosh, we keep drawing the land, too. That's ridiculous. Out he goes, and we're just going to swing and see what happens. I'm not going to play into a counter spell. This winding way is way too important for that. So we're just going to pass. That's it. I can't get this countered. I have to let them tap out. Okay, passing straight back. Wow, that's a lot of land, holy crap, that's a lot of land. I kind of shouldn't have played the mountain, honestly. I should have just played another plains or forest. Ah, that is, that's interesting. Oh, okay, Simic. Hmm, what are we on about here, huh? You're holding up a counter spell like a mother fricker. That's for dang sure, all right. We can bait with the sinew. I need to do something here. Whoa. Do you not have a counter? What? Do you not have a counter? You counter. You counter that. Whoa. Okay, bet. Um, hmm. I'm a little lost. <laughs> I'm a little lost. Uh, I don't know <laughs> why you wouldn't counter Lord and then, wh like, what are you doing? Okay, yeah, sure. I guess that's fair enough. They don't want to show me their deck. Simic with Bone Splitter. Well, Pyroblast, yeah. Hunter, I'm guessing? Not necessary. I don't know, though. Simic makes me think fog. Like mill fog, like turbo fog or something, but like that bone splitter. What's with the bone splitter? I don't know enough about what we're up against here. So I think until I know, I'm just going to bring in Pyroblast and cut a Sentinel. Yeah. What else could this be? else could this be I'm trying to i'm really trying to like the bone splitter on the simic is really throwing me for a loop not quite sure what's going on there oh that's tempting uh, <laughs> we just need one land and we gem hide it up and double virulent oh you know it's bad mm, you know it's you know i shouldn't do this right I shouldn't be doing this. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Just one land. That's all we that's all we need. Oh no. It's already happening. <laughs> Just one land, please. That's all I need for a gem hide. It can be another forest, I don't care. Simic growth chamber, floating one blue. Sure, but are you actually gonna use the blue? Or are you just being flat? You're just being flashy. Okay. Um. Oh, frick. <laughs> I mean, we have double poisonous, so that's chill. But like, why can't we? 
what what did how does that work how does that work i want to know the statistics on that of like you keeping a one land hand and just never drawing land just never drawing it i i don't know seagate oracle what well at least it can block our virulence which is pretty annoying actually but we need these guys to have a little bit of toughness so we can just swing in and keep getting in for poisonous. Oh my gosh. That is three. Wow. Um, all right. <laughs> well, we should not be passing with trifecta virulence out right now. Holy frick. Why does this always happen? I can never keep a one lander. I can never keep it. I swear. If I lose against some crummy Simic deck, I'm going to be pissed. Even if it's just game two. <laughs> like, come on. I do want to know what's going on. What is this deck? Oh my freaking gosh, it's impossible. It's actually impossible. Well, we go for the six, right? We go for the six poisonous. I don't know what they could be holding up, but we go for the six, we put them to eight. Seems reasonable. If we win with one land and three trifecta virulence, that'd be pretty crazy, and I don't know what to think of this deck at all. You know? I just don't. I can't believe we're not hitting a land here. We have so much in our hand. We have two. Uh, we have both our. Oh, frick me. Why wouldn't they do that before? I'm getting rid of the winding wave. We've got plenty of plays here on that. Get rid of the plated. Why wouldn't they do that mid combat? Why would they take. Six poisonous. Okay, this guy's just a noob. He's just a noob. That's all he is. He's a noob. We wouldn't. You have echoing truth and you don't play it to just bounce all my stuff. Is this just like. Is this acid trip? This is acid trip. Ah, man, every time there's a Simic deck that I can't figure out, it's always Acid Trip. Every single time, I swear. But they're not finding their crap. They are not finding their crap. Holy frick, we gotta land. Wow. Do I call red here to just start holding the Pyroblast? I think I do actually, because I'm not. If I get down gem hide, then we're fine. I don't know. I'm going to play it for the pyroblast situation, because we might need it. take two that's fine it's not a huge deal uh, when Drake enters a battlefield sacrifice it unless you exile creature you control other than warm fang yeah there's got to be a reason they're swinging out there right when warm fang Drake leaves the battlefield return exile card okay interesting So this is Acid Trip, but they are not finding their stuff. Good news is, we can get down. Are they holding up Counterspell? We didn't see any Counterspell. Because part of me wants to go for the Gem Hide, and then drop the other Vivalin, and then just secure our win here. But like... Could this be the turn that they hold it up and then we're... You know what I mean? 
I guess we do have to go for it because I have two blockers. So if I want to win next turn, I do need to get down three creatures. So, as much as I don't necessarily like doing this, I'm going to see if this sticks. It does. Okay, out goes the other Viverlint. They all land, double poisonous, and we've got our mana. Finally. Sorry uh, for the title of the video. It'll just be, you know, Nice Slivers versus Acid Trip. And then you're, you guys get to watch me <laughs> try to figure out that we're playing Acid Trip for 10 minutes. <laughs> oh, man. I, I swear, like, every time I do play them, though, it's like, oh, Simic, what? Fog? Mill? I don't know. And, like, the first game, they, like, never play their crap, and you can't figure it out. And then second game, you're like, oh, Acid Trip. And then they go off. I'll take three. I don't know why you're really attacking here. Oh, it's flying anyways. I can't do shiz about that. What's your follow-up? Better be good, because I have a Pyroblast ready to counter any of your crap. They need to, like, launch an Acid Trip and then pop it, like, ASAP. Oh, driving Heath. Very nice. Uh, are they just going to concede because they know they lost? I think so. We're lagged out. I think they conceded. Come on. Let me counter. Oh, they didn't. Okay. All right. All right. All right. We're going. We're going still. Uh, we've got a red. We're good. Um, bing, bing, bang, bang, boom. Yeah, we swing. We swing, and we hold up Pyroblast. I don't see why not. If they got another Echoing Truth, it's going to get countered. And you die. Oh, here it comes. Let's see if this is enough. They still got a lot of mana up. Is that enough? Oh, they got the follow-up. All right. Well. Hmm. 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 They had the plays. And we lose a lot of stuff. Which is unfortunate. I think we had to go for it there, though. We had the Power Blast. They weren't showing any signs of doing anything special. That was a blowout, though. That was a bad blowout. Not gonna lie. Hit for five. We get to put down a lord, and that's it next turn. Mall Drifter fully, fully equipped with the car draw. So I got one land, so ideally there's a bone splitter. And that's going to put him to five. Interesting. Yeah. I think we're dead now. I think we are dead now. Hmm. Was I too eager? Should I have just... Uh, hmm. Played a lord and passed now? I mean, they were vague. They could do... They could do stuff. Uh, all right. Well. We're not quite... Uh, let's see. Are we dead? Five, six, seven, eight, we'll go to one. They're not even going to full swing out. All right. They're just going to hit for five. They're not even going to equip. Okay. Gosh dang, it took forever to draw our land. Ugh. Oh. Oh, oh, where's your acid trip? Are you just trying to like, is, is this, are we not playing acid trip? Are you, am I tripping? Is it, is this just your win con worm fang?
So I have to play a lord. And hope they don't attack correctly and then pyroblast one of them. I mean, if they just swing out, they win, but... Maybe they'll make a mistake. Uh, they could have put me to one last turn if they really wanted to. Sure. Coiling Oracle. What? Bone Splitter again. You gonna actually equip it this turn? Because that'll do it. Let's just make sure they do the attack. Yeah, all right, that's fine. We'll go to game three against their Simic mid-range, I guess. Oh, the woes, the woes of not finding a land. Spinneret, now you're in. What else? I guess that's it. Could bring in Swift Response, but I think Pyroblast is versatile. Now for we can take out creatures or counter, and that's fine. We just need to be fast. They're a slow deck. They're a really slow deck. Yes, play first. I guess I will keep this. It's still pretty flooded, which isn't ideal. You know? Not ideal. Let's see what we can do. Go! Don't have a turn one play, unfortunately. No trifecta virulent for you this time. Maybe later. Maybe later. I'll get you going. Okay? I'll get you. It's gonna be a slow roll. Um ba 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 plated. Go. We're just gonna start setting up with our gem hide a little bit. Oh, okay. You're a dick. That's fine, we still get to put out muscle plated. Maybe I should have just played the, uh, that is negative one, right? Yeah, I guess I should have led with the Lord, huh? We knew about Piracy Charm, too. Lead with the Lord. Let's like that. Keep drawing the gas, baby. No brakes, all gas, right? Alright. We still have those Echoing Truths and stuff. If we go this whole match... It's just such a weird one. Such a weird deck. I guess that's all it is, right? Simic mid-range? Not very strong. It's very slow. Okay. Okay. I like that. I like that. Now we're, you know, more susceptible to that echoing truth. But uh, I'm not going to not play it in this position, you know. We're still getting in for... Eight, unless they want to chump. Here we go. Vapor snag. Sure. No chump. Okay. That's fine. Next turn, if they don't hold up a counter spell or something, which we still have yet to see. Dream stalker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring back Coiling. Get your lands. Ramp your lands. Alright. What do I want here? Thriving Heath. Well, our mana's right. That's fine. I guess I kind of want a Winding Way first. See what we hit. The Muscle. Okay. So like a va Vapor Snag again, but uh, if they do, that's fine. We're still going to take uh, some damage. 
No vapor snag. Take an eight. Go on to ten. Yeah? No? Oh, here it comes. I spoke too soon. <laughs> All right. They're taking three again. Coiling Oracle about to come down. Get another land. Oh, Seagate Oracle's coming down. These dang blockers are going to be a nuisance, but... I am worried about a really bad... Okay, they're tapping out. That's fine. Coiling Oracle, so we can get down both our lords. No problem. I want a one-drop next turn. That's what I want. Just to empty our hand and really get it popping. Or a Pyroblast. I would love to have a Pyroblast held up now at this point. This is a good place for it. Just four lords on the battlefield, the plated, and then a Pyroblast backup for a nice swing in. Two cards in hand for them, by the way. Planes is not what I wanted to see. I probably should have just held it in hand, bluffed the Pyroblast, but so be it. Getting in for a lot, though. We can get past all the chumpers. There's a chump on the Oracle. They're taking 10. They go to 6. Fine by me. Two cards in hand. Do you have something to get you out of this? Probably. Yeah, well, another Oracle. Pop the island. When did they reveal this? I didn't even see that. Is that what they got for Seagate? Uh oh. Turn not. Kicker. Turn not. Draw a card. Okay, so they can remove one of our guys. Scary with that. That is not great. Were they really trying to target my land there? Confusing. I don't know if they played their island. They got into the roll, though. That, yeah, that's all they have left in hand. Okay, I have to compare here. Into the roll is what they have left, so they can bounce one of my lords. Just one, right? And then if it's kicked, they draw a card, which they cannot kick. So they're down to just... I think they just die? Let's go swinging. Oops, not undo. Attack all, swing out. Oh, no, they're not dead yet. No, they're not. Because they can bounce one and then block to oblivion. That's fine. Self to block everything. And I get to play this boy back down. And this. Call red. Get rid of that. Zero cards in hand. Alright, can we call this a game? Can we move past this? Wonky deck. <laughs> Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed that wonkiness. The non- acid trip acid trip deck literally has almost everything that an acid trip deck would have minus acid trip it's got to be hiding in there somewhere right how could it not be i don't know i never saw it we never saw it all three games pretty crazy uh but yeah leave a like if you enjoyed make sure to subscribe support the channel i appreciate it stay tuned for more slivers we're getting the more slivers going all week so stay tuned for that and we will see you guys in the next video